Hello friends, today I'm going to talk about formal verification of system and chip. You must have heard a lot about system and chips and formal verification and today I want to share some of the good stuff about formal verification uh, being applied on system and chip. I am Ashish Tabari, I'm founder and CEO of Axiomize. We founded Axiomize in February of 2018 with the vision of making formal mainstream for all design verification. I've been a user of Formal for over 20 years, and I'm passionate about teaching and innovation and applying Formal in the field. I have the experience of bringing up design verification teams in different companies in the past. I have worked closely with busy managers and design verification leads and engineers, so I have a good understanding of what they need. And I have trained and enabled uh, nearly 100 engineers uh, check out uh, our website www.xmise.com slash testimonial to read about uh, some, what some of the people say about the training that I've done. The question to you, my friends, is if you are building SOCs or building IP components such as CPUs, the GPUs, your I squared Cs, or the interconnect, and if you're in the business of putting these things together, how do you know that these things work as intended? How do you carry out your verification? How do you know that all masters in your fabric get access to the shared memory infinitely often? How do you know that multi-master systems do not modify shared memory illegally ever? How do you make those guarantees? All Snoop requests that are sent to memory always remain in order. How do we make sure that this is always the case? Or for example, no master can ever starve to access the peripheral such as UART, I squared C or memory. How do we know that caches remain coherent with main memory at all times, that all instructions in your processors always produce the correct outcome? A lot of very complex verification challenges occur because of concurrency and control. And the fact that you have data flow in your design happening concurrently between multi-mastered, multi-slave systems. To try and get a confidence in the quality of verification, you need to think beyond your simulation cycles. Formal verification is a great way to establish that you don't have these bugs in your design. And I can, you can actually not only find bugs, but also prove their absence. If you are interested in learning more about how formal verification can help, Axiomize offers formal verification training, the best formal verification training you can find in the industry. And we offer our consulting services and our outsourcing facilities, all of which are designed to help you get on with formal verification and enjoy formal verification. Take your first step towards becoming a pro. Come and start your formal verification journey with us.